It's always great to see you, pal. How are you? Thank you. For, I'm doing fantastic. Are thank, you? Thank you. Yeah. Good. Yeah, thank you for uh, coming <laughs> back on the show. Thanks for having me. It's freezing in here. No, 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 it's not. For a gal wearing no clothes, it's kind of cold. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, yeah. kind of cold. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, last time you were here, I made you do a bunch of impressions. Yeah, we you ran did. through them. Uh -huh. uh, uh, can, can you give me a little, give me a little Holly it was, Hunter? Uh, oh, uh, Jimmy, hi. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Uh, Kathleen Turner. Listen, Jimmy, I've been, I haven't been, I haven't had my own show in a long time. <laughs> and Drew Barrymore. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> 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 Uh, have you run into any of these? Uh... Uh, you know, it's funny because I didn't realize how that could be a, a potentially a, be a problem. Because yeah, somebody some might people be a little not, offended. Don't like it. Yeah. yeah, people don't like it. Yeah, uh, I ran into Drew Barrymore and Ellen DeGeneres. Is, that's a really big name. Should, should I pick that up? No, yeah, you yeah, dropped okay. a couple. Yeah, yeah. Ellen DeGeneres. Ellen is... DeGeneres' is, uh, 60th birthday party. <gasps> and Drew Barrymore was there. And yes. all of a sudden I had this like white out in terror thinking like, I did an impression of her on national television. She may hate my guts, but she didn't. No. no. She, she thought I was okay. She was like, Sarah, that was such a good impression. <laughs> she was like, that's true. I thought that's it was not, so, not, so accurate. Sarah was it was so, so accurate. accurate. Uh, do you have... <laughs> she was, it was so, I feel it was super so honored. It's so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> that's what she said to you at yeah, Ellen's party. At yeah. Ellen's party. Uh, <laughs> did you bring any other impressions for um, us, please? Yeah, you know, I do, I do an impression of Juliette Lewis in Cape Fear. Oh, I love Cape Fear. Robert okay. De Niro, yeah? Yeah, you know okay, him, right? Sure, I know okay. Juliette Lewis, too. Yeah, okay. This is great. Okay, so it's from the movie. Yep, Cape okay. Fear, Juliette Cape Fear, Lewis. Juliette Lewis, ready? Yeah, here we go. Oh, my God. Wait, you're the one who killed my mom's dog, right? <laughs> Come on, come on, wherever you are! Oh, see, that's very good. Uh, but now you, you actually you, you decided to not do celebrity impressions anymore. You want to do... Animals. Because, you know, you don't have to worry about running into them at a party. Oh, you never know what not parties you go guy. to. My, mine is a dolphin, and uh -huh. I don't want to see a dolphin at a party. <laughs> that would really freak me out. Yeah. So you could do a dolphin right now? Yeah. All right, I'll close my... Wow. That's, fa <laughs> that's fantastic. Oh, my God. Sorry, I'm just looking online. Uh, Flipper is pissed right now. <laughs> it's like, oh my, I didn't even know Flipper was still around. I thought like Flipper was going to be on FaceTime or <laughs> yeah, something. Like, I was like, wow, that's great. Yeah, don't, stop talking about me. Uh, <laughs> Ocean's 8, everyone's talking about this. A lot of buzz around this movie. How yeah. fun was this? What a cast. It was kind of crazy. Sandra you've got Bullock. like, you've got Sandra Bullock, you've got Mindy Kaling, you've got Kate Mindy Blanchett, Kaling. you've got, oh. you know, Rihanna. Yeah, you've got Kate Blanchett. But you, then it kind of puts you in a tiny bit of like a, you don't know what line to straddle. You've got like, bitch better have my money. And then you've got like Shakespeare's R Us on the other side with, Kate, with okay. like Kate, where you're like, oh, are you reading Thoreau? I should probably read that Thoreau too. Yeah. You know, and then Rihanna, yeah. you're like, can I just sit near you? <laughs> <laughs> you just want you know, to be cool yeah, around her? Yeah, I wanted to be cool around her. I, she you is know, super duper cool. I wish I'd worn a diaper when I met her, because I sort of. <laughs> Just, uh, just a little bit? Just a little tiny. tiny. <laughs> just like a little squirt. Uh, no, no. I don't now, mean don't, a bit. No, I know, no. You meant, you know, you meant, meant the, the, one, the, the good the one, the good one, the good one. The good, the classy one. The good kind. The classy the one. The kind that everyone would understand. <laughs> I would never think of you Nobody as doing the other way. The other never, one. never, 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 ever. I don't even do it at all. No, nor do I. No. Are you kidding me? This is just, going downhill just, so fast. <laughs> To get in so much trouble. No, you will not. Okay. I want to talk. Let's talk about this film. Let's talk about the movie. Now, in the movie, uh, you're you're at the Met Gala. Yep. And someone's trying to steal a 150, 150 million, million dollar, dollar necklace, jewels. Cartier necklace. Yes. Because mm -hmm. uh, Sandy Bullock plays Debbie Ocean, who is the sister of Danny Ocean, played by George Clooney in the original franchise. That's right. And he's producing. And this he's one. producing this one. And um, she's been in jail for over five years, eight months, twelve days, planning this heist. And she enlists seven girls, women, who are very, very good at their jobs. Uh, I happen to be one of them. It's interesting, because I saw you at the Met Gala. You did see me at the Met Gala. Did you enjoy it? Did you, have, you look I beautiful. I did, thank you. Yeah. I, um... Did you think of stealing anything? Well, it is. I, what I did do is I took my tequila with my friend Bruce Bozzi. Do you know, you know I Bruce? I love Bruce Bozzi, yeah. So we uh, were told we couldn't bring our tequila, which we were still enjoying, yeah. uh, into the other part of the area where Madonna was about to perform. 
and we decided that just sounded like a bad idea to not have our tequila while we were going to watch Madonna, basically in a private concert in, you know, in, the museum. in the museum. Yeah. You know, so we took it. How did you smuggle um, tequila into the next room? He put it in his pants. <laughs> Like, right down the pants, and, and every time we were walking and I sort of picked up the pace, he'd be like, could you slow down? I've got, like, lots of things are... He put like it in his pants? Like a tequila soaked Johnson. Yeah, it was so a thing. So he put it in his pants? Yeah. He and then put, like, a glass like of a glass liquid? Like a glass Yeah, yeah. And uh -huh. then he walked? He walked around. Did, did he walk like... Did he walk like... Like, did he... He was trying to be a little more conspicuous, inconspicuous. Yeah, so he's walking with he's you. He's walking, and, he's and going I'm this, walking, and then I'm... Getting into the next room. He sure wasn't doing that to me. But was he... Was he cruising? Was he just like, I don't know how... I don't know how I would do that. I but, like, but what, what you're doing is, like, pointing it out. He was more, like, trying to... Sucking in? Con yeah, he was like... Yeah, we yeah. don't look conspicuous at all. No, no we're, we're not doing anything, you guys. We're just having fun at the at the Met Gala. Uh, yeah. Oh, no. oh, don't move. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, I, I have the ice in mine, and you just have the liquid in yours. Uh, wait, so you okay. did, and you got it, and you smuggled it? We smuggled it, and then by the time we got it and were able to actually drink it, there was, like, this much left because it had all spilled in his pants. <laughs> I was like, uh, did you drop your trousers? I am thirsty. All right, here we go. I have... Guys, I... <laughs> You did that. That's great. Sworn and on and on. Ah, I said. And it's sworn and on and on.